Uh, and my name is Ho Wei, and I'm uh, from San Jose, California. Nice to meet. And, and I'm 63, and I'm a retire, not really, not really retire. <laughs> I'm, I'm, a, I'm a actually a hardware, hardware engineer before. Okay. Uh, yeah. So I have actually two questions. The first question is, I'm disabled, and I often time I, I have problem on when I write in code because I only have one hand. I have make a lot of mistakes, and I'm doing not that fast. And instead of waiting to the end to compile the code and find out all these typo errors, yeah, I was wondering, I mean. is there any any method, any new technology that can enable a disabled person to program to write code more better, more efficient, and more effective? Yeah, I'm really glad you asked this today because Tommy is exactly the person that I would ask this question of. Tommy, do you want to speak to this? Yeah, so we're uh, so I'm actually currently working on a project to help people with disabilities write code. So uh, a good friend of mine was in a similar condition. He injured both of his wrists and, and basically couldn't use a keyboard at all. And so we're building this new product called Serenade. You can go to serenade.ai. Uh, and it's basically a platform to let you write code by speaking rather than typing. And so, you know, there's there's no need to use a keyboard at all. You could just dictate code by saying something like create a function, add an argument, add a return value, uh, and we'll sort of write all the syntactically correct code for you. So, uh, yeah, that's that's something that we hope we hope will help folks with disabilities. Um, and there's some other software out there as well, Dictation in general. Uh, you know, it's built into Mac OS, so you uh, you know can tell the Mac to click different things. And so there's there's lots of cool software coming out to help folks with uh, different disabilities use a computer more effectively.